Let's now bring in Emily Finn for the latest on Nikki Haley. Emily, a lot of people wondering what her fate looks like as we move forward. Today could really be Haley's last chance to remain competitive with Trump. Absolutely, Marky. Make or break for sure. Haley has indicated that she is staying in the race as long as she still continues to receive support from voters, but that could all change. After today, there's a lot of delegates up for grabs. Haley is coming off her only win so far in the primaries in D.C. She kicked off an aggressive campaign tour, making stops in North Carolina, Maine, Vermont, and Massachusetts, ending the string of events in Texas last night. She held a final rally in Fort Worth, one of the states voting in today's primary elections. At some point, maybe we should say the reason that America keeps losing is because of Donald Trump. <laughs> but in order to change it, it's going to take a lot of courage. Courage from everybody here. Courage for me to run. And courage for every one of you to know, don't complain about what happens in a general election if you don't That's vote right. in this primary. Haley's team then returned to South Carolina so she could be on her home turf this morning, where voters tell us they're preparing for her to potentially drop out. What about her donors? So if the donors see Super Tuesday as a wash or it doesn't turn out as well as she expected, then the donors will back up and then that'll force her to make a decision. I think she's done really well, um, but I think she's going to have to acquiesce and just give it up and say, you know what, I gave it my best. Uh, let's leave it up to the man. And the man being? The Trump. And something that we've been keeping a very close eye on here, Haley's campaign has not scheduled any events for after Super Tuesday. They also don't have any uh, ads uh, scheduled to be released as well. So maybe an indication that she's potentially preparing to bow out, Marky. Yeah, she already has had some donors uh, bow out after the last primary. We'll, we'll see if uh, any surprises are in store for her today and what the future holds. Emily Finn, thanks so much. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.